In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the issue where your YouTube description link is not clickable. So if you have a YouTube video and you have this description here with a link inside of it, but nobody can click on this link, then there's basically two different things you need to do to fix this issue. Now, the first solution is just to open up the YouTube website, click on your profile icon in the top right hand side, scroll down to the bottom and click on settings. Now scroll down again and select channel status and features and right below feature eligibility we need to make sure this third one here, advanced features, is turned on and enabled. So if you click on the drop down arrow next to it, you can see here that in order to be able to use external links in your video descriptions, we need to meet one of these requirements. So for my channel, you can see that this is already enabled, but if you don't have this enabled, then just make sure to go and complete that. Now, this could be as simple as verifying your phone number on your Google account, and sometimes it involves just a bit of channel history on your YouTube account. So you can see here as long as you follow the community guidelines this can take around two months in order to be approved for these features so once this is enabled what we can do is head back over to our youtube video and the next thing you want to do is in your video description where you're creating this link you need to make sure this is actually a full link containing the full url of the website so just typing in facebook.com unfortunately isn't good enough so what you would need to do is head over to the actual website of where you're trying to link to so for example example, if it was Facebook, I would just launch up Facebook, come up to the URL section at the top here, and we're just going to copy all of this website address, then you can come back over to YouTube. And we're now going to paste in that URL. And you can see here is now the full website URL link. And if I now go and save my changes on this YouTube video, this link will now be clickable. And that's it, guys. If you did find this video helpful, then let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next.